remember to shut the stream off, uh, record a disk. This is going to be about the uh, new um, CPU coming out by uh, AMD, which is the uh, Bulldozer. Now, the Bulldozer itself is not uh, the specific name for the CPUs that come out, but uh, rather more a uh, architecture which is different from their other ones which is I believe uh, AMD 64 type processors um, let me see I've got a bunch of uh, notes written down I'm kinda of going over it real quick now it seems uh, okay it's selling for a price point around two hundred forty five dollars now this is uh, I think their most um, powerful processor I think it's the AMD FX uh, 8150 yeah, I'm going to go ahead and give you some of the specs on that because for uh, home builders, this, this might be a good option for you. Um, it's an 8-core, single chip, uh, gig, uh, basic gigahertz is 3.6 gigahertz. It kind of has its own uh, turbo mode similar to Intel. I'm not sure what they call it, but uh, the turbo mode on that is 4.2 gigahertz for like single threaded um, applications. Uh, it is overclockable uh, to 4.6 gigahertz. Uh, obviously, you got it's using their software, the AMD software. I'm not sure what they call it really. Um, now, it only work with AM, AM3 Plus sockets. Uh, you can't use AM3 sockets. It's got to be the AM3 Plus. Um, now. I've kind of been looking about, you know, uh, on the different uh, websites and, and so forth. Um, I think it'd still be a good option, um, but the only thing is the performance uh, is a bit lackluster from what I'm seeing uh, described in some of the reviews. And um, for uh, you know, I know benchmarks you can only take per se with a grain of salt. So um, on some of the benchmarks, uh, it's got some high scores. On some other benchmarks it's got lower scores um, but even comparing to an older version of even its own processor which is I believe the AMD Phenom 2 6 core for instance um, even that seems to be a bit better performance uh, than this uh, newer one and comparing it with the Intel version even a uh, Intel i5 2500k Sandy Bridge uh, you know seems a better uh, a bit uh, uh, better uh, performance. Now, of course, AMD for a long time has always been about value compared to perhaps performance power. So, I still I still think it's going to be a great um, for do-it-yourself builders. Uh, I'm not saying its performance is any better or worse than any other ones. You know, you just uh, take it at face value and go see it for yourself. Um, Oh, I also got written down here, and some uh, multi-threaded apps uh, did not do much better than the... Oh, that's why I just mentioned that Phenom Core, Phenom 2X6 six core. And, uh, okay, I'm going to go ahead and 